This is my revolution. Soon will be my arrival. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Revolution. And after what I just saw, this man Danny Nash is going to be a force to be reckoned with. Danny Nash debuts this Sunday at Humble Beginnings. But anyway, let's get back to this match. As tonight, Justin Frazier of the Triple Threat Trifecta takes on Daniel Killzone. Later on tonight, Kyle Nixon and Jason Justice have a tag team match, number one contenders match. To see who will face Mars kills on the Daniel kills on this Sunday at Humble Beginnings. But well, Justin Frazier tonight has an important, a very, very important matchup here tonight. And ladies and gentlemen, there he is. The new and improved Daniel Killzone. Daniel kills on showing this new attitude of his. I don't like this new attitude Daniel Killzone has. It completely disgusts me. And the way he's just been carrying himself, just aligning himself with this damn conspiracy against the NECW makes me sick. Last week his brother defeated Kyle Nixon. But tonight, let's see what this man, Daniel Killzone, could do in this matchup against Justin Frazier. There we go, we're underway now. Justin Frazier and Daniel Killzone going one on one, the two powerhouses of both factions. Now look at this, Daniel Killzone going to work at a shoulder block. Just going for the arm here of Justin Frazier. Now Justin Frazier's in trouble. Now an a hammer lock being applied here by Daniel Killzone. And a punch to the back once again. Now Frazier's in trouble. Now look at this, Frazier now with a, with a, with a lock of his own here. Another, now a hammer lock being applied by Fleischer. Just impressive chain wrestling being shown by these two. Last week... Mars kills on defeated Kyle Nixon. And tonight, Justin Frazier issued a challenge to Daniel Killzone. And Daniel Killzone said he was on. And now look at this. Try to go for a power bomb. And Daniel Killzone now with that reversal. Turning the tables on Justin Frazier. Frazier's in trouble. Now look at this. Daniel Killzone looking for one of his own. Has him up. Kyle Driver. What a maneuver by Daniel Killzone. Daniel Killzone now, look at this. Elbow to the skull. Daniel Killzone has Justin Frazier. Frazier's in deep trouble here. Now kick to the gut. Frazier now. Better find a way to recuperate here. Into the corner, Frazier goes. And now Daniel Killzone unloading. Daniel Killzone with another one. So you just gotta tell you, this ruthless, this ruthless style of Daniel Killzone is unpredictable. Oh, and a reversal by Frazier. Frazier now has Killzone. Frazier, look at this. Kick to the gut. Frazier now. Neck breaker by Frazier. Now here's the cover by Frazier. Looking to end it early here. And only a one count. I gotta tell you, this tag team division nowadays in NECW is more and more competitive. Especially with the new arrival of the Killzone Brothers of the MWE Conspiracy. And now look at this. Sharoni by Frazier. Here's the cover. Right, again, looking to put him away. Shoulders are down. And only a two count. I tell you, that Sharoni took a lot out of Daniel Killzone here. But that was not enough to put away Daniel Killzone, the former MWE champion. Now look at this. And a, and a knee to the face of Daniel Killzone. Daniel Killzone's really struggling on his debut match here in NECW. Now look at this. Killzone with that reversal. Now look at this. Killzone now just unloading on Frazier with those mounted punches. This could be a, this could be the preview of what has to become 
Well, of what's to come for the team that wins the no more contenders match this Sunday. There goes Frazier over the ropes. This could be a glimpse of what might what happen this Sunday between the two tag teams. What? Whichever tag team the kill zones face. Now look at this. Into the table. Now Daniel Killzone is just assaulting Justin Frazier. My God, this is just a this is just a brawl here after what happened last after what happened weeks ago when Daniel Killzone attacked and Daniel Killzone and Marks Killzone attacked the triple threat trifecta. And now Daniel Killzone just unloading once again. What a seven count outside the ring. Both men better find a way to get back in the ring here. At an eight already. Into the corner. Oh my god, that ruthless, just this ruthless style of Daniel Killzone. And now Frazier back into the ring. Now Killzone's going to the top. We've never really seen this before from Killzone. Now Killzone's on the top rope. What's going to happen here? Killzone setting up for something on the top rope. Double axe handle. Just taking out Frazier. Here's the cover by Killzone. We have a two. Shoulders are down. Frazier gets the shoulder up. The resiliency from Frazier is just unprecedented here. Now, Killzone now is just trying to find a way to take out Frazier. Now, punch to the face. And now another one, and Frazier's on the ropes. Frazier's in trouble on the ropes again. Frazier, and a ball in that kitchen sink. Just leveling. De Justin Frazier. Justin Frazier has a trouble. Claw. The claw to the shoulders. The shoulder claw is locked in. Frazier is in deep trouble. Better find a way to get out of this. I'll tell you, look at the pressure on the shoulders and the trapeze area of Justin Frazier. Just the pressure is just lethal at this point. And now Frazier just finding a way, trying to get out of it, trying to ease the, the pain here. Frazier, Frazier now, look at this, trips him, gets out of it. Frazier now is out of comeback, Frazier, Frazier. Frazier now, look, Frazier now, look at this. Frazier on a roll, look at this. Frazier now on at the corner, look at this. Here we go, and a clothesline, and look at this, followed up by a bulldog. What a sequence from Justin Frazier. Frazier's on a roll. Frazier has him on the shoulders. What's this? Is Frazier going to finish him here? Look at this. Burning hammer to Daniel Killzone. Here's the cover. We have a two shoulders and down. Daniel Killzone gets the shoulder up. Frazier almost had him. Daniel Killzone still manages to kick out. And oh, wow, what a maneuver by Frazier. A shooting star press headbutt. Here's the cover. No. Killzone still kicked out, and Frazier cannot believe it. And now Daniel Killzone with that reversal. Now look at this. Killzone with the kill bomb. That is it. What a match this is to Killzone. And Killzone gets the victory! Killzone just getting the win here. And there's your victor, folks. What a matchup this was. Wait a minute. What the hell? Oh, no. Oh, come on. Oh, come on! What the hell is this all about? Come on! The match is over, damn it! Come on! It's adding insult to injury. Coming up next, folks, Azizo Fenrir takes on Andrew Fleischer in a match to, in order to set up for this Sunday's last man standing match between Zack Phantom and Azizo Fenrir. Fenrir vows to send a message to Zack Phantom before this Sunday's humble beginnings. And tonight, he's here to make an example out of Andrew Fleischer. What will happen when we return on Revolution? Here we 
go, folks. The match is underway as Ezekiel Fenrir makes his way to the ring. Cecil Fenrir earlier tonight told Zack Phantom that this match is just an example of what's to come at this Sunday's humble beginnings and that last man standing match. But this is also a great opportunity for Sean Oliver because tonight, Sean Oliver's opponent, Andrew Fleischer, takes on this man and Andrew Fleischer can be softened, uh, softened up before his big first blood match of the All-American Championship this Sunday at Humble Beginnings. Like I said, Zack Phantom better be careful what the hell he's wished for. Because this man is nothing to be fucked with. And ladies and gentlemen, there he is. The man that will challenge for the All-American Championship this Sunday at Humble Beginnings. I feel really, truly sorry for Andrew Fleischer in this matchup. He has an angry giant in his, in his vicinity. And tonight, I feel like he will not be walking out he will not be walking out, he'll be carried out by the time Fenrir is done with him. And that's something that is very unpleasant, especially when it comes to a man like Azizel Fenrir. And here we go, we're underway. And look at this, Fenrir, Fleischer trying to go after him already. And now, oh my lord! It's like Fleischer went, ran into a damn brick wall. And a big boot taking him out. Fleischer better find a way to recuperate. Because Fleischer is in deep trouble. He just has an angry giant in his vicinity here. Oh my god, Fleischer's a dead. Now, Fenner is just going to work on Fleischer. I gotta tell you, Zach Fenner better be careful what the hell he has wished for in the, for this Sunday. Because this Sunday will be no laughing matter. And look at this! Phantom on the apron trying to distract Azizel Fenrir. And now look at this, look at this! Fleischer's trying to steal it! Fleischer with the roll up, two, and F Fenrir. Kicks out. Flacer nearly stole it. Now Flacer. Now again, Flacer rolling Fenrir up. Really trying to get out of here quickly. Fenrir gets out of that one. And now Flacer trying. Oh, that didn't even phase him. And another punch. And that did not even phase him either. And now Fenrir now unloading on him. Look at this on the shoulders. What a backbreaker by Fenrir. Fenrir going for the cover on Fleischer. Two, and Fleischer gets the shoulder up. Fleischer's in trouble. That that pressure just being applied to Fleischer's shoulder. My God! And now just toying around with him is 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 Ezel Fenrir. Now Fenrir again. Oh my God! Into the corner. With all the force in the world. And now again, Fleischer's in trouble. And another powerful whip into the other corner. Now again, another whip into the corner. Just punishing Fleischer. And there goes Fleischer out of the ring. Fenrir's just destroying Andrew Fleischer at this point. What a three count outside the ring now. And now, oh my lord, a punch sending... Fleischer back first onto the announcer's table. And now into the corner of the barricade. Fleischer's in trouble. And oh my lord, a throat thrust to the throat. And now look at this. Zack Phantom just telling Fenrir off. And now Fenrir just is not even worried about it. 
Now what? Oh, come on. Now Fleischer just distracting him once again. Now, oh my lord, that super kick to the nuts. And Fleischer's just now taking control. Now what's Fleischer going to go for here after that damn distraction from Phantom? And a clothesline from the apron. That damn distraction from that damn asshole, Zack Phantom. Trying to cost Fender in the match. And now look at this. Here's the cover by, F by Fleischer. Fleischer with the cover. We have a two. And F Fenrir gets the shoulder up again. That was not enough to put away Azizel Fenrir. What will it take to put away the big man? No, Fenrir with that reversal. Kick to the gut. Now Fenrir now has him. Back into the corner here. And oh, look at look at that reversal by Fleischer. What a Yuranagi that was. And here's the cover on, Fle on Fenrir. And only a two count. My God, what a reversal by Fleischer. Now look at this. Fenrir already with a comeback. Look at this. Has him up looking for that Alabama slammer. Alabama slam connects from Andrew Fleischer. Here's the cover to put away Fleischer again. And there is the kick out by Fleischer. What will it take to put away Fenrir? I mean, Fleischer. Now look at this. Fenrir's looking to set up. Fenrir's going to set up for that bear hug spine buster. Oh, I'm going to try to go for that clothesline. And a reversal by Fleischer with an Enzigiri. Nice reversal by Fenrir. By Fleischer. Now Fleischer has him. What's going to happen here? Fenrir now is outside. Throws him outside of the ring. Look at this. Let's, what's he going to set up for here? Look at this. Tornado DDT by Fleischer. What a maneuver by Fleischer. And meanwhile, Zach Fenrir just threw a chair into the damn ring. Now look at this. Fleischer just talking shit to Fenrir. Look at this. is a striking. The ref, come on. No, no, my God! While the referee was distracted, Fleischer just doing the damage. My God, that damn Zack Phantom needs to be removed from ringside. Now look at this. Fleischer now has Fenrir. Fenrir's in trouble. Now Fenrir over the ropes. Now low and a reversal by, Fle by Fenrir. Fenrir now looking to set up. Punch to the gut. Now Fenrir now after exposing the turnbuckle. Oh, it's the exposed turnbuckle. Now Fenrir looking to set up for that bear, for that clothesline. Fenrir is going to set up. Uh oh, Fenrir now is on, trying to make a comeback here. They on vintage Fenrir. Fenrir now has him. There goes Fleischer into the corner. Now look at this. Fenrir is on a roll now. Now look at this. Into the corner again. And another body splash. Now look at this, has him up, look at this, sidewalk slam from Fenrir. Now Fenrir now looking to make a comeback, look at this. Fenrir now, look at this, that bear hug spine buster from Fenrir. That is it, it is over. Oh, now come on, not again. Distracting the ref again. Now let's, there's a clothesline, that devastating clothesline from Fenrir. And now look at the distraction wasn't enough. Here's the cover on Fleischer. And Fenrir picks up the victory. What a matchup from these two. And Fenrir has just decimated Andrew Fleischer. <laughs> Fenrir gets the victory after that devastating clothesline from hell. I did. It's clothesline from hell. The distractions were not enough for Zach Fa for Andrew Fleischer, but it took him so far, and it still ended up with Andrew Fleischer getting destroyed. Now, wait a minute. Fenrir is not done with Fleischer. He's looking, he's looking to send a message to Zack Phantom before this Sunday's humble beginnings. Now look at this. 
Oh, and what an impact to the ropes with that flat jack. This is a reminder being sent to Zack Phantom. Now look at this. Has him by the throat. Choke slam by Fenrir. Now Fenrir now looking to set up again. Fenrir looking to send a message. But sending a message to Phantom. That damn clothesline. That will this be the fate of Zack Phantom this Sunday? Phantom, as you cowardly run away onto that ramp, let this be a reminder of what's to come this Sunday at Humble Beginnings. Because this is what you're going to look like after I'm done with you this Sunday. And when that bell rings and that 10 count is upon you over your fallen carcass, that will be your only reminder of who we are. The MWE is nothing compared to this illustrious company. And you, just because you are a former MWE champion, doesn't mean that you have automatically have prestige here in this company. Respect is earned. I've already earned it. So if you have a problem with that, then oh well. And another thing, if you think that this is the demise of this company, it's really not. It's just your own little fantasy that cannot come true. It's just that little visions that you've been seeing with MJ Styles. But kid, there's nothing you can do. Because when I have you this Sunday, that is your last warning. Sleep well tonight. Because you're not going to do, because you're not going to be walking out this Sunday after Humble Beginnings. What a strong message that was from Azizel Fenrir. But what will happen this Sunday? Coming up next, it will be the tag team number one contenders match to say who will face Mars and Daniel Killzone this Sunday at Humble Beginnings for the new NECW World Tag Team Championships. The Triple Threat Trifecta, two halves of the Triple Threat Trifecta, Kyle Nixon and Jason Justice face the brothers known as Doom, Slayer, and Onslaught. It happens next on Revolution, who will become the number one contenders.